Hey there, it's Kayla, your language coach for non-native English speakers working as professionals, business owners, and entrepreneurs. And today's training is on a special topic that I get requested and get questions on all the time on social media, and that is how to become more fluent. And when I talk about becoming more fluent, I'm talking about limitless fluency and being able to reach your wildest dreams when you think of how fluent and how expressive you wanna be in your English communication. So to do this, what we're going to need to tap into or talk about in this training is the limitless mindset. So what is the limitless mindset? This is a mindset where you see that the sky is the limit for you, that in whatever area of your life you're currently you know, working towards a goal in, you can always improve and do better. You can always find a way. And a big part of this is always looking for where the opportunities are and seeing every moment as a lesson learned and an opportunity for growth, improvement, enhancement in some aspect and area of your fluency. Rather than criticizing yourself or making yourself feel negative about different experiences that you're having in your fluency that maybe just feel like they're not there for you yet. So when you decide for yourself that limitless fluency is for you, that you are capable of it, that you are worthy of it, and that you are going all in on it, that's when it truly becomes accessible for you because you can start to really perceive in a drastically different way every single experience that you have within your English fluency. And I'm going to give you an example within a linguistic atmosphere that I have experienced many, 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 many times and that resonates very deeply with my own uh, personal journey in learning another language as an adult. So in this example, let's say you have a new vocabulary term uh, phrase, whether that's a professional or a social, colloquial, informal one, you are going to be using it for the first time in a new situation. And I know most of you can probably resonate with me on this, so I'm, I'm really, really remembering very concrete moments in my own language learning journey uh, in my non-native language of Spanish as I walk you through this training. So let's take the example of you're going to use this new term or phrase for the very first time in a public set setting, and you wanna make sure that you're using it well, you wanna make sure you're pronouncing it right, all the things. So let's say that in this moment of using the new term, you mispronounce it or you use the term not in the correct way and the immediate reaction, but like instantaneous reaction from everyone is hysterical laughter. So you could easily turn this into a negative story about your fluency in your head, which is what the majority of us tend to do the first times that this happens to us, right? You might think that, okay, well, I'm just destined to be stuck at this level of fluency forever, or people think I don't sound very intelligent in English, or what's the point of even speaking if every time I open my mouth, people laugh at me, or I'm never going to be better in my pronunciation or accent because every time I use a new word, people just laugh because they don't understand it or I sound funny. And you could just keep going on and on and on in that negative and downward loop and spiral that will not serve you in the long run with your fluency goals. Now let's look at this through the lens of the limitless mindset and how much this could completely change and revolutionize how you are looking for growth and opportunity as a fluent speaker of English. And this will actually strengthen your communication capacities. It will make you feel supported, much more supported as a communicator uh, within your own capacities. And it will also strengthen your relationships with other people. So let's say you perceive this in a different way. And you're like, okay, um, something about what I just said sounds really funny when people first hear it. And that was just their innate or immediate reaction to it. I'm really curious to know why it was so funny. Let me laugh along with them and see where the learning opportunity is so I can do this better next time. Once the idea is explained to you, you're like, oh wow, that is really funny. I can't believe I just did that. And because you had this really unique memory and experience that is tied to this linguistic uh, opportunity for growth, 99% of the time you are not going to forget how to use this term or pronounce this term in the right way the next time because you had such an impactful experience where you were able to be appropriately corrected on that thing in the past. Now I want you to think of a past memory that's maybe been a little bit vulnerable, sensitive, or uncomfortable for you as in 
uh, English speaker and fluent speaker of English. And think about that experience in hindsight. What were you actually doing? What was going through your mind? What were you experiencing in that moment? And find a way to reframe on purpose every single negative thought, emotion, or connotation that you have with that experience. What's the lesson that you learn from it? What is something positive you can take out of it? What is an area of growth that you were able to experience from that very split second, that very specific moment that now you have carried with you as a communicator in becoming a more fluent version of you? And just by doing that, you'll have started to step into this limitless mindset and you can start practicing this more and more and more over time as a fluent speaker of English. Now, if you'd like to become the most fluent and free version of yourself in English and you feel like you just want some more fun, support and guidance in that experience, you can always join at any time the Fluent and Free Masterclass. I will leave the link for this in the description below so you can get all the details on it. But this is the most transformative training that I've ever made packed all into one to help you become the most liberated, expressive, and real authentic version of you in English. Share with me in the comments how you are going to be a more fluent or free version of yourself next time you reach or encounter one of these linguistic or uh, fluency barriers within your day-to-day -day work or professional life so that we can celebrate this new fluent mindset with you. Welcome to the Limitless Mindset and I'll see you in the next video training.